chapter 14, lesson 1, is about understanding fractions. So this is uh, the section where I think some parents would start having doubts about their capacities to teach their children because fractions could have been a nightmare for them when they were younger. So hopefully the strategies that we will show you here in these videos will remove those fears and so that you won't pass it on to your own kids. So fractions, pretty much what it does is we take a whole and we divide it into equal parts. So a fraction has two parts, which is the top number, which is the numerator, and the bottom number. So a fraction has the numerator and the denominator. Okay, so um, the problems that we will be doing will be from page 79. Okay, on page 79, problem number one has a picture um, of three triangles. Okay, two of which are shaded. Okay, so the question says blank parts out of the blank part, equal parts are shaded. So blank parts, so this is two out of the three equal parts are shaded. So this is the shaded, shaded. Okay, so then it says we need to translate that into a fraction, which means that would be two thirds of the figure is shaded. Okay, but when we go to problem number two, letter A, we now have a circle that's divided into five parts. Okay, from the five parts, two are shaded. Okay, so the question says blank parts of the blank parts of the blank equal parts are not shaded. So this is not shaded. Okay, so there's three out of the five are not shaded, making it three-fifths of the whole figure is not shaded. So um, again, parents, it's, it could be daunting, but this is an easy start first. So you just need to show your kids how to recognize a figure, recognize how to count the number of parts that will be on the bottom. And the, what you want is gonna be on the top. So those are either the shaded or the not shaded part. That concludes lesson one of chapter 14. See you in the next lesson.